What is up, YouTube fam? Welcome back to my channel. Um, I hope you guys have been having a blessed and wonderful uh, day today, okay? Or if you, I don't know, you know what, maybe I don't say that. Maybe I don't say that. Maybe I don't say that because I don't know when I'm gonna post the video. But yeah, you guys, um, right now we are out and about. My husband is doing some Ubers right now, so we're getting those done. And then we are supposed to have dinner tonight. I was thinking of doing like a little fun game since it's just me and him, you know? Um, I think that would be fantastic. But he up in this here, uh, this here uh, McDonald's right now, getting the people's food. We just finished a couple other Ubers today. We did Starbucks, one for Starbucks, one for, what was it? Did we, what was it? I forgot that fast. Oh, Popeyes. Yo, I didn't know Popeyes sold fish sandwiches. Just sidebar real quick. Like I didn't, I, I thought they only sold chicken. When did they start this? Like we just got a new Popeyes up the street from where we live. I was complaining because I was like, ain't no Popeyes around here. I want Popeyes, you know, I miss the red beans and rice and them biscuits. Okay, I don't care what nobody say. Um, the chicken has changed though. At least the strips anyway. Popeyes, you could do a little bit better. I don't know what that was. You know when the meat just tastes like flimsy? Like, why is it flimsy? Like, why is it doing that? Like, I don't want it to be hard, you know, and stiff. And like, it's gotta be just right. You know what I'm saying? If it's too flimsy, it's like, some's off. Some is just, mm -mm, limp chicken. Not that it was that bad, but <laughs> that's just, that was the first thing that came to my mind was limp chicken. Uh, but yeah, y'all. So, um, I think I'm gonna insert in here too, because earlier today we did something fun that I wanted um, to put on the video. We went out to the mall, and like this is a good, like fun um, couple's idea, like when you don't really have money to be shopping in the first place, but you just go in there, you pick each other's outfits out, you know, at your favorite store or whatever. Shoot, if you wanted to, well, I don't know if they'll let you. I feel like certain stores wouldn't let you, like. Y'all, you know, I'm not rich, right? <laughs> like, I'm believing that one day I will be wealthy, but like, I don't know how they do it, Gucci or whatever. Y'all, y'all be trying to, I guess you got to. You got to. I would think you gotta be able to try to go on. First time that's happened to us, somebody picking up the order before us. Um, that's great. Well, when the two D next. Oh. <sighs> All right, guys. I had to give me a snack. We just got back to the house after doing a few Ubers, and now we're here, getting ready to play our game. Stuff together. I had to get you a drink and everything. Are you having you? I see you in the first one. Why are you? Y'all, let me tell you how whack I am. <laughs> I told my husband I didn't want any popcorn. He popped the popcorn, ate the whole bag, and then after that, I realized I wanted some. I just needed a snack. I just had a habit. I don't know. It's like in the moment you don't feel like you want it, and then after somebody brings it out and you smell it. Oh. Y'all know Ray don't like to be on camera. <laughs> I just feel like people love it when he's here. They love it when you're here. Alright. So we're gonna play. Would you rather? Are you ready? Baby, you gotta be enthusiastic. All right, first one. And this is just the both of us. We'll just do both of us. Would you rather be completely hairless 
or yes. as hairy as a gorilla. Hairless. Wow. The swim faster. That's good. I I I feel like no woman wants to be hairy like a gorilla, okay? I would just be, yeah, I'll be completely hairless. I'll be bald. She got a lot of hair. So you trying to put me out in front of you too? That's how you feel. Yeah. That ain't none of their business. Well, everybody got hair right there. You got hair, man. We're gonna move along, okay? Would you rather live a hundred years in the past or a hundred years in the future? I feel like both of these. What's your what's your answer? So you're gonna be a hundred years in the future? Yeah. Obviously. See, and I said the opposite. I'm not gonna be Django up in here. <laughs> I look. I said the opposite. A hundred years in the past, just because the direction our world is going in, I feel like it's worse than the, worse than being a slave. That's what nineteen twenty-two. Nah, that's almost a great depression right there. Hey. A hundred, a hundred years from now, the direction our world is already going in. You know the Bible says it's going to get worse. <clears throat> you can rewind me. You can rewind me because if, if it's going to get worse, then I don't want it. <laughs> okay? All right. Would you rather have a personal maid or a personal chef? Maid. Yeah, I would have to say maid too. The food is great, but it's like when you have kids... The house is like always dirty. Okay. <laughs> you can clean up and it's gonna get dirty in another five minutes. So yeah. I definitely agree with the maid. Um, would you rather have a frog's head or frog legs? Head. <laughs> Wait to eat or like you have to have I feel like it's to eat because I'm doing legs. Oh if you have to eat then legs. I'm about to say that's what yeah, they didn't even I just wanna if I had a frog head, I'd go with the tongue. Working. Oh, okay, that's head. probably what they meant. Yeah, but the, I feel like the frog's not gonna be functioning if you just got a head. You just get something from over there and you. This is the oddest question. <laughs> okay, but if you have the rest of your body, are you gonna be functioning properly? Don't worry about it. I guess all you need is your brain. All I need is a frog. I don't know. Tongue. But yeah, would you rather have a clone of yourself or a clone of me? <laughs> Which one? It means I got two of you. You got a clone of yourself or a clone That's of me. I'm saying Doesn't you mean you can have two of me, weirdo. Well then what is, it doesn't make sense then. Raymond, the Lord Jesus is listening to you. I'm saying, so you, you is it saying, can I have two of you? Is that what the, is that what it's asking? Okay. I guess. I want two. Of you. This can be cute in a way, but it also can be very <laughs> the other way. Um. <clears throat> I'll make y'all sit. You sit here. Two the other one sit here. Kiss, kiss my cheeks. Oh, can I get? No. <laughs> See? Oh. I would say two of Ray. He said he always wanted another sibling. But not to have. I have a sibling. I but you said you wanted more siblings, like a brother. More, brother. Siblings, more siblings. Yeah. I think if he had a brother, seeing them together would be funny as a mother. So I would say two of him. Alright. Would you rather have three eyes or three arms? Three arms. Slap me three times. So <laughs> you get more work done. No, that be. I need you need four for like to be for second stuff. What you gonna do? Three four. arms. Slap me three times with it. Yeah. Okay. I would say three arms because I feel like you get more done. The eyes is just I feel like you'd be confused about where you're looking. <laughs> but don't flies have like a bunch of eyes? They have two eyes, but there's a whole bunch of different viewpoints. Okay. 
Yeah, that's too much. Um, would you rather be remembered for something awful or forgotten about completely? We're all gonna be forgotten about completely. So I'll say that. Yeah, I was insane. I don't agree, but I, I'm saying that because I don't want to be remembered for anything awful. Because it's either be be Hitler, be remembered as Hitler, or be remembered as his brother that nobody knows. I'd rather be the brother that nobody knows. Yeah. Okay. Why does popcorn feel so dry? I need some butter. Okay. Would you rather never gain weight from junk food or never... This one's done because we don't drink. So next, um... I know. <laughs> I'll, I'll take what, what he's got. Um, would you rather have to dance every time you walk or sing every time you speak? Sing. Yeah, I would say sing too. Is it why people are gonna think you weird? But they might think you're just funny if you sing like every time you speak a little bit. But if you just like dancing everywhere you walk. <laughs> I don't know. Both are weird. Would you rather date someone twenty years younger than you? Okay, I'll do mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, this. Would you rather Whoa, I'm thirty. Okay. Would you yeah, hello. <laughs> Would you rather I be twenty years younger than you or twenty years older? I thought it was a no brainer. You could be older. 20 years younger? When I'm 60. You know, but you're not right now. You're 30. Okay. So you're dating a child. That's sick. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> Would you rather be. Y'all excuse me because I'm smacking with my mouth on. Would you rather be bald or have a mullet? Bald. I'll take the mullet, because it doesn't I don't have to style it in a mullet. There's gonna be a mullet. Well, you can still style it different. Well, I still feel like I'd be cute. You're gonna love your I just feel like I'd be cute. I don't care. Alright. Joe Dirt. Yeah, I feel like cute. Would you rather take a vacation with your boss or never go on vacation again? Guess me and the boss is going. If I had a boss, I would say probably the same I'm thing. the boss. Moving along. Would you rather be gorgeous and married to someone ugly? Okay, would you rather you were gorgeous and married to me and I was ugly? Or ugly and married to me and I was gorgeous? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I mean, I'm already gorgeous, isn't it? so it's already. <laughs> Not really be ugly. And, uh, maybe somebody gorgeous. I try to be worried that soul is better. I feel like still suck. But <clears throat> last one: Would you rather be able to speak in any language, or be able to talk to animals? Animals. Explain. Talk to the chipmunks, squirrels, chilling. Go to the beach, talk to the whales and dolphins. Like, well, I talk to people. Everybody, you talk to people, it's gonna be like the same conversation you have every day. When I talk to a, a dog, or a, you know, Sasquatch. That's hard because, like, when I travel to different countries, it'd be cool to know people are saying. Cause what if you were like they talking just like you were at the house? Yeah, but they're not gonna let you speak. That they could be saying something crazy, trying to kidnap you, but you would know. They don't go nowhere crazy. It doesn't mean, babe. There's somebody crazy everywhere you go. 
Oh, same and with a bear. Too. Same with say say in the woods you see a bear. You you gonna sit there and let it kill you? You gonna be like, hey, what's up, bro? You know, dab it up. Mm-hmm. You're the one. You still got the ammo. See, she ain't talking to me. Yeah. Up. At least you'll know. Sometimes, you know, you be sitting there and you don't know what the bear's gonna do. But then you'll be like, hey, you trying to eat me? And you'll be like, nah, bro. And then you dap them up and go your way. I have to poop. Hey guys, okay, so um, we're getting ready for dinner i don't know what we're having for dinner um doesn't really matter we're just going to be able to spend time together so that's going to be fun that's going to be great i have on the dress that i showed y'all in the video right now but of course i'm not going to show you the full thing because yeah you know <clears throat> um i don't know why i'm acting so weird right now i'm acting really weird i'm just hoping he does not come in while i'm trying to film i think i need to or i'm trying to get ready let me shut the door Okay, yeah. So, I'm gonna put my makeup on now. Um, just got out the shower. I feel like it, it frizzied up my hair a little bit, but you know, it's doable, right? It's not, it's not horrible. There we go. There we go. And that. Okay, it's makeup time. Let's do this. Let's see what I'm going to do. Uh, probably shouldn't use this because my hair is down. I feel like it's just gonna get all over my hair, so I'm gonna find my. And I messed this thing all up, y'all. This is my um, my tart. Not the joke here. It don't matter. Okay. Anyway. <clears throat> But I'm gonna tell him to grab some candles from the Dollar Tree. So we got our candles, got the little flowers in the vase or whatever. Um, so yeah, we decided to um, make dinner. So we're getting some, we do some jerk shrimp. We're making quesadillas. Jerk shrimp quesadillas. It'll be so good, okay? Can't wait for him to hurry up and get back because I'm ready. Okay, it's finna go down. It's finna go all the way, all the way. What a way So yeah, we'll let y'all, you know, join in on the festivities just a little bit um, here. So I hope you guys. So yeah, like when we're doing something, I don't know, romantic, you know. So when we're doing something romantic, I like to kind of. So when we're doing something like this, where we do dinner at home, I like to try to make it as romantic as possible. Um, so got the you know that's why i got the flowers and the getting the candles and all that good stuff hopefully so everything can look nice and pretty you know dim the lights and we're gonna enjoy okay 
okay. Look, y'all, this is like, really, you know, I felt, I really wanted to do something, you know, bougie, over the top, whatever. Um, but sometimes it's just not in the budget and that's okay. So when it's not, do little stuff like this. Like these are fake flowers. I didn't have to go get no real ones. It's cute enough, okay? It serves the purpose <laughs> here. I mean, and then when y'all can afford to do the other stuff you want to do, then do it, of course. But yeah, just make the most of of what you have. Make the most of life with your with your spouse, with your children. Um, and sometimes it can be so easy to get caught up in like, well, you know, we don't have this or have that um, or whatever, you know. But like I said in a couple of my other videos, you also got to be mindful what you say out of your mouth. So maybe we don't have it yet, but right now we're still gonna make the most of this because we're still we're still blessed regardless, even in our little. So we're gonna make the most of this. We're gonna have fun um, and all that good stuff. Why? Why get so down in the dumps that you just don't do anything at all? That you just ruin the whole mood or the whole you know like the whole thing. It doesn't have to be um, like the worst days of your life it's really i'm learning like it's really what you make it you know what i'm saying it's really your mindset around it um that affects things um but if you have a different mindset you and your spouse like y'all can have fun even when it you know times feel rough even when times aren't the way you want it to be um and it can e be feel easy to feel ashamed about it too but don't even feel ashamed about what season you're in that don't feel ashamed because Sorry. But I was saying, even sometimes, like, you can get in a place where you feel ashamed about the season you're in. But never feel ashamed because it's a season God can get the glory out of. It's a season where you can be um, molded and shaped and pruned. It's a season where you can grow, where you can um, just learn to enjoy what you have. Learn to be in con content, you know, with the things that you have. So... This is me being content, y'all, okay? Um, and stuff, but, you know, we were supposed to go on, on vacation this week. You know what I'm saying? And we didn't get to go, but, and I was down, yeah, I, I cried, I cried my tears. I really did because for the last hmm, five years, we planned three different trips together and they all failed. Um, but it's just, you know, and that, and that can make you feel like, oh, you know what I'm saying? But I'm just choosing to have joy. I'm choosing to praise God regardless of my circumstances. And I'm choosing to trust him regardless of what it looks like. I'm choosing not to allow the enemy to put me down in the dumps um, because I don't have XYZ right now or I'm not where I want to be right now. You know what I'm saying? Um, but I'm going to take this opportunity to learn. I'm going to take this opportunity to grow. I'm going to take this opportunity to smile, to have joy in spite of it, regardless. Because then then I feel like I will appreciate more when where I want to be comes. You know, I feel like I would appreciate it more if I can appreciate this space too. Otherwise, I feel like I'll just be like, okay, what's the next thing? Because I'm bored with this art. You know what I'm saying? I want to be like that. I want to be grateful for every season, every moment. I want to be grateful. And um, I just hope this encourages y'all to do the same. I feel like crying. Ah, okay. But yeah. <laughs> Ray should be back soon. <laughs> No, you know what I did at the end? And spring was all. What the heck kind of cheers is that? Cheers. 
Oh yeah, that's Thank you.